Hello, my beautiful Capricorns! Single Capricorns, welcome to September reading. This is a general energy for all of you. Either you are single or consider yourself single. Let's see, darlings. This also could be a love reading, a finance reading. Why not a health reading? Usually, I'm not gonna go too much if it's about health because no, the doctors should diagnose. However, sometimes the spirits want to let you know certain things ahead of time because, you know, even though the spiritual world and the spirit world actually are going to give you much more insights than you even sometimes expect. Let's see, darlings, what do we have for September and how these energies are for you? We have a Queen of Swords, Hierophant, the Emperor, Knight of Wands, Six of Cups, Eight of Wands, Page of Pentacles, and Eight of Cups. Okay, who you are dealing here? Because it seems here that you you are back and forth with someone for some time, but doesn't feel like you are gonna be for too long. For some of you, you might even um, go to to the thing that you are not gonna talk with them again. I don't feel here this person takes serious what you're gonna say, but they will after. Okay, it's like you you make a choice here, and that's not the joke. Why this person might not taking you seriously? Because you could done this before and you came back, or you start communicating with them again. Because I definitely see here that was a another conversation and then we talk again and talk again but so far i feel here some of you you might be around someone but they they're not taking it serious the way you do or what you do i'm also hearing counseling for some of you you could go through counseling Or somebody here needs counseling. And I feel here this is an issue this person go through. It could be taking responsibility to what they do or how they do certain things. But so far I feel here you, you feel like even this person is going, neither the counseling doesn't work or something. I'm, I'm hearing therapy, counseling, things like that. I have Six of Wands. We have Ace of Swords. Four of Cups. And the World. Somebody here needs to go to a full set of things. It's kind of if you go to a course, you're going to finalize the course. If you, it's kind of somebody here go somewhere and they are pretty great, better, and then, then, then again. So it's kind of like a yo-yo effect here situation. And the counseling could be related to family issues or family or families or certain things like that. For others of you, this is a... Um, This is about the, um, the past or someone's past or someone's father figure from the past. It's like the, somebody here is stepping into the, um, the father's steps. If the father was this way, they can be this way or they are doing the same thing. And I feel here this person done some progress, but not complete. With the Four of Cups, it's kind of once they feel much better or once they feel like 
I got this, I can do this, then they go back. Could be certain addictions, somebody here is like, once they do great, after a while, then they bounce back. And somebody here is just kind of like, not gonna go. It's like, it's not passing six months and then they go back. Could pass just four months and they are back. What's the four of cups here? The star. I wish I could handle this. I wish I could have this or for the future where I dream about this, I want this. But once one is to want a thing, to continue, to keep it, and one is to doing it. It's like somebody here says certain things, but they might not doing it completely. Yeah. Yeah, look at this, the full energy. Like somebody here, it's in the, in the dream la-la land here. I'll take it again. I will do it again. And so on, so on, so It's kind of starting, ending, starting, ending. For some of you, you could start and end a relationship here with someone a couple times. But what's, what's the over energy here with the world? The hangman. So it's kind of a start and start and doesn't move anywhere. Somebody here needs to see the things much different. And I feel here the one who see the things differently, it's you. It's kind of breaking the cycle. Hangman, the tower and the ace of pentacles. Yes, it seems here that you darlings break the cycle moving towards something completely new because you you realize that this is not gonna go don't get me wrong i feel here other areas of life are great are, are actually amazing but there is a specific area here that it's kind of one step forward one or two step back and somebody here just cannot live in a back and forth energy and that's more likely as i said it's you the eight of cups queen of cups i allow this so i can move away from this kind of jail of life for some of you, this could be a work situation that you feel like in a prison. Yes, you could be an independent contractor and you want to be free, but actually you are always tied up into the work. Always, always. The only eight is missing here is the pentacles. Yes, you work, work, work. But I don't see you happy. It's not like you don't love this. You do. But you are making an active decision here. The Two of Swords. Three of Cups. The Hangman, the, the Devil. And the Four of Pentacles. Three of Swords. Look at here. The Two of Swords is kind of like this company you are in or this environment where you are in. It's kind of you. It's a constant vessel. It's like a wheel in a constant way. It's like, you know, when, when you have a drug and it's given to you just as much as you can go forward. Like how they say for the, um, the depression pills. Usually to be happy, we need to increase the serotonin in our brains, in our bodies, let's say that. But 
that the pills for the depression are not long or not enough serotonin to move forward. It's just keeping you at the same dosage just to keep you in the loop. I needed more, I needed more. So that's kind of a thing here. You don't have the possibility to jump higher, go forward. And now you take that change. If either you are dealing here with a person, either this is your career. It's not like you're doing bad or anything like that, no. But I feel here that the main reason, as many of you know, the main reason of freedom is to not work constantly. Or the main reason of entrepreneurship is to, to have freedom to do other things than you, you can, and so on. Let's see, what else? Knight of Swords, King of Cups, and Ten of Cups. Yeah, for some of you, what you your main thing is to be happy, to, to do you, to feel okay with you. And that's what you are going towards. You are heading towards this. And you are heading pretty fast. Fathers of you, this is about a person who is always, always working, 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 and you never seen them. Whatever the energy, again, whatever starts, it's, it's from your side. Okay, loves. It's, it's kind of like you, you give yourself the chance to do what's right for you. And that's the, the big move you are going to do this month. A new beginning. But this new beginning is not something you... You, you kind of, you don't expect this way. You have certain ideas or idea, but this is not, not nothing like you could feel like that's, that's the way I do. However, Spirit says you definitely will love it and you definitely will enjoy it. I also hear that there is need of some adjustment. So take it slow regards that adjustment okay with the seven of cups lovers hermit and ten of wands it's kind of a reset of your true power and what you should do next so many many capricorns are in a reset time underneath we have the seven of swords you you kind of want to escape from a situation, but, but Spirit says that's not the point. Once you are going to do the right thing for the right reason, the right cause, then you will understand where you stand and what you really need to do. So Capricorns, quite a month to, to get organized, reorganized, and yeah, I feel here something here, it's already decided. I've done that, I know that. Next. And it seems here you definitely are going towards it. Love and light loves. For those of you who have been married and now separated for quite some time before we going with the reading. For those of you who go through counseling, yeah, you are separated. It's kind of only what holds you back is the kids or something like that. But for some of you, it's like 
when you got, got married or got together with this person, you were kids. You were like kids. But there's something here you don't want to continue. There's a big, big no, no. I don't want to do this. I don't want to go to this. I don't want to stick with this environment. I don't want to be around this environment. There's something here's like no. So definitely here it's it's a completely new life for some of you on the horizon. What I can say for you darlings is you're going to need a lot of strength. But I definitely feel here you you don't even discover your true power. The best is yet to come, darlings. See ya, Capricorns. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.